Fate comes by hearing and hearing the word of God. You're listening to The Moment of Power with Azano Eddie Thompson. Daily audio devotions to energize your day presented by the Advent Hero Ministries. Our moment of power topic today is make a mark of difference. But as for you, you taught evil against me. But God meant it unto good to bring to pass as it is this day to save much people alive. Genesis 50 verse 20. Joseph was a type of Christ in many ways, including being a savior of the world. He used his gifts, his gift of dream interpretation and management to save the world from starvation. His life made a difference and made the world a better place. That's what God wants for every of his children. Abraham Lincoln was first exposed to the horrors of the slave market as a teenager. I think he was 19 at the time. He was especially moved and saddened by the unctioning of a black man who was obstinate. It was said that he told someone, maybe a friend, that he was going to deal with slavery when he becomes president. Although he had only 12 months of formal education, he educated himself, contested and contested and contested until he won. Then he signed the Emancipation Proclamation that should free slaves in America in January 1st, 1863. Lincoln believed in the clause that all men are created equal as found in the U.S. Declaration of Independence which Thomas Edison penned in 1776. I would say he believed this phrase more than even the founding fathers who kept holding slaves even after the signing of the Declaration of Independence. Lincoln's bold stand against man's institutionalized inhumanity to man made the world a better place. He made a mark of difference. In spite of Lincoln's efforts to end slavery and segregation, small-minded people and a mammoth system kept segregation and inequality going. It took another bold reformer, Martin Luther King Jr., to complete what people like Lincoln began. He too made a huge difference in the lives of people. He didn't leave the world the way he met it. Sonia Cassin made a difference by raising sons that blessed the world, Ben Carson being the most popular. If you read his books, then you will know that they are all about his mother. You will also agree that when all the world, including himself, had lost all hope in him, his mother kept believing in him, his mother kept pushing him, his mother instilled in him the discipline of study and it turned his life around and turned the world of many people around. He was transformed from an inner city dog kid into a world-renowned pediatric neurosurgeon. History is filled with people who have made a real difference in the world. They have made a mark. History is filled with scientists, politicians, mothers, fathers, teachers, mentors, philanthropists, freedom fighters, missionaries, ordinary people who resolutely said no to evil and mediocrity. Many are even unsung heroes that we may not know about. Only eternity will reveal the results of their efforts. The greatest of all is Jesus Christ. He has left an everlasting mark of love in the heart of millions. Those he touched their lives 
in turn touched the lives of millions of others. They became ambassadors of righteousness and positivity. God created you to make a mark. He did not create you to be a cause or an agent of unrighteousness and destruction. Turn your life over to Jesus Christ today and you will be inspired to make a difference, to make a mark for good and eternity. This is the moment of power. Be blessed today in Jesus' name. Amen.